Now we're going to talk about social network submissions. Before we go to that, we need to do something that we did with account profiles. We need a place to save URLs of all the submissions that we make. Just like this file here that we have for saving our username and password. We need to have the same for saving URLs. Creating such a list is easy to do. All you need to do is go to New and then URL List. Just click on it and then you will get a new list which you're going to rename. Let's say we want to name this Online Dating. If you're doing a campaign or project for online dating then this would be a suitable name. So Online Dating. If we go ahead and double click it you can open it. Right now there's nothing in it but once we submit URLs this list is going to get filled up with all the URLs that are to use throughout this submission process. Now we can go ahead and go to social networks. To do that we need to go to new and then submissions and social network. We have this over here and I'm also going to rename it. Let's say I'm just going to name going to name the name of my article. Three tips for online dating. I'm going to go ahead and open this up. Over here I have a couple of accounts that I have usernames and passwords with. As you can see I have four selected. I could go ahead and select all of them or select all with PR or I could select submitted sites, unsubmitted sites, and failed sites. Right now, I'm just going to select those that I have accounts with. Now, you could go ahead and select all. If you don't have an account with a particular website, Rank Builder NEO is actually just going to skip it in a couple of seconds, so you're not going to waste a lot of time with that. So you could definitely select all of them. Before we go ahead and start the submission process, we need to make sure the project profile here is selected. If we created accounts under profile number one, then you want to make sure we select that profile. Also, if we want to store the URLs on online dating, then you want to make sure we select the right list over here. Now, if you don't create a URL list, then this is going to be empty and the software is going to tell you to create one. If you forget, you can always go back and create one and then come back here and proceed with the submissions. All right, now let's move on to the second tab here, which is the Submit Information tab. Over here, we have a place for an article title. This is spinnable, as you can see, so let's go ahead and insert something. We could do three tips or we can ask the software to spin this for us into three easy techniques, for example, for attracting, we can say women, or we could also say dates online. Now, over here, we'll need to insert a couple of keywords that are related to our article. We could do online dating, meeting, or what else can we say? Getting to know women online, Facebook dating, maybe and something like that. You'll just insert your keywords in there and this is spinnable as well. Now another way is you could spin more than just two keywords. For example, so you could just go ahead and add three techniques if you don't want to say easy techniques and you could do this for as many keywords and, and as you want. There's no limit to the amount of spin tags as you can have. You can extend this to 50 if you want. There is just no limit. Over here, we have the body in which we're just going to paste our article. I picked up an article from easingarticles.com. Let me just copy it in my other monitor and, and going to paste it in there. I'm going to leave this article source. Now, Let's say you want to place a link somewhere inside this article. Now, what I don't recommend is going too heavy on the links. You definitely don't want to do more than three links. I think that should be the maximum. Two or three links. 
that's what we recommend. Otherwise, this might look spammy to the websites you're submitting this to, and they might delete your account or your article. You want to make sure you don't go too heavy on the links. Now, let me show you how to post the link. Let's say your keyword is, let's see, attracting a woman. Let's say that's your keyword. Then you would have to do this. You would put less than and then a h ref and you open these quotes. Actually, the equal sign goes first. So you go a h ref then equals and then you open the quotes and then over there goes your URL. Let's say your URL is datingonline.com. Then you would close quotes and also close with the greater than sign. That's it. Now, over here would go your keyword. Once the keyword is over, you would go ahead and open again with these signs and then slash A and you end with a greater than sign. That's it. This is where your keyword goes. Your keyword should go between these tags. So you open with a h ref, then equals, open quotes. Your site goes inside the quotes. Then you close with the greater than sign. Then goes your keyword, less than slash, a greater than, and that's it. You can do this for another keyword. Let's say your other keyword is, I don't know, let's say attention online. Probably not the best keyword, but it doesn't really matter. If this is just an example, your link is now bing.com and you close that attention online and then we close like this and that's it. This is another link. Now, if we move this up, you're going to see that we have a preview button. Let's go ahead and click it. You're going to see that our keywords are now links here. They're visible and clickable. That's what the tags we kind of did to the text. This is how the keywords are going to appear. I'm going to go ahead and close this. Now, let's take a look at these two tabs. URLs. This is going to get filled up after the submission and also logs, which also is going to let us know what happened with, uh, with us on the sites. Now, if we go back to submit account, let's review this one more time. And if everything is okay, then we can go ahead and click start and the submission process begins. As you can see, it has 25 sites. It already started strong with, with already 10 successful submissions. As you can see, I don't even need to pause the video because this is going to be over and probably less than 30 seconds. So 22 from 25, 23, 24, and the last one should be done in just a couple of seconds. All right, that's it. As you can see, you're very, very fast and, and very, very successful. This is really important and this is a very good success rate. Most software out there doesn't get that well and they have a lot more failed websites. With Rank Builder NEO, it's built differently and, and that's why we get a much higher success rate. I'm just gonna hit the OK button. Now, if we go here, you're gonna see the URLs and if you're going to logs, you also can see everything that happened inside Rank Builder NEO. You can always clear the log if you want. I'm gonna close this. Now, if we go here to URLs and then open this up, you're gonna see the URLs are here as well. That's it. That's how to use social network submissions with Rank Builder NEO. In our next video, we're gonna talk about social bookmarking.